Welcome to Isle of Segal. So, if you didn't pick up where we left off, Olivia Hall, our hacking expert, figured out that Janus's body was shipped to Isle of Segal. This is where the Ark Society takes place. And this is where the Constant would be. So, what we do, we capture the Constant, we do not eliminate him, we steal him, we kidnap him. I can either just eliminate these two fucks, but basically these two are the leaders of the Ark Society, the chairwoman of the Ark Society. Normally it would just be a, a singular chairman or a chairwoman, but these are twin sisters, and they're very similar, so... They, they can both take the throne, and it doesn't matter. I mean, besides, having one for other shit, and one for other shit... Look, I don't know. Um... Basically, these people have kill switches. And basically, what their kill switches do, if the constant is ever compromised or anything, they can immediately kill the constant to avoid spilling any beans about the Providence Partners. What the fuck? Whoa. Okay, whatever. Anyway, guys, I've dressed myself as Santa, taken a gold bar, a lockpick, um, fiber, do I want fiber wire, or do I want, um, the ancestral fountain pen? I don't know what the frick that is, but it sounds cool, so, yeah. So, guys, time to assassinate these people, guys. Basically, these two people are like treasure hunters. So, like... They're pretty bad people. We we can agree that not just being like big ass roadblocks and sons of bitches to our plan. They are also yes, whatever. Wow, a bunch of rich people doing rich people shit. These people are. Ah, one more. I see. Won't you join us, sir? We were just about to begin. No. I have good evening, ladies. Uh, I see someone's in a hurry to get inside. Well, have a good evening, sir. Hey, you. Where do you think you're going? Definitely not through here. Get out of my face. Hello. Merry Christmas. Do you want some presents? Do you want some Maybe. presents? Whoa. Pianist, violinist. I don't mind him seeing a but honestly, it's not my business anymore. Rich people you stuff. can't pass here. So move along. You look like the spirit of the season. Especially on my table. When did I remember? Ah, uh, yes, Santa drinking wine. How very Santa-ly and christmas -ly must be. Right, and all I think about is how No drinking on the job, 47. You sign all three friends. Friends. Seems like the Okay. Maybe I can... Oh. How are you trespassing? Keep it clean in here. Like this? <laughs> that was funny. Anyway. Anyway. Okay, I don't want to sound like Jar Jar Banks. Hmm. How are you today, sir? How about now? Employees only. Well, I'm glad I'm rich, though. I was rich before I married him, and 
Okay, she's like me, so... Okay, yes, this is not trespassing. Cigar box. Smoking? Yeah. Rich people. I don't know, I'm just trying to blend in here. Uh, wow, this is a beautiful freaking castle, and it's really, like, giving me a headache. Commemorative token. Why would I want that? Hey, why not? Oh. You didn't see me. Don't worry. Okay, thank you. You are a good man. And to be honest, I'm not trying to trespass, I'm trying to do... Ugh. Thank you for not looking at me. Oh. This isn't trespassing. I have been planning the Founder's Wake for over a month. I have some of the world's most prominent people waiting That's to him. pay their last the Constant. Respect. Providence's top star, controller. Star, Everything depends on world. capturing him alive. Oh. For God's sake! And you're telling me that you lost the sodding dagger? I'm really sorry, man. I could have sworn on you. No notification. Well, you sure Earth. they didn't give you a crate number? They did not. If it was me. Number, I was told you people would have it under control. Fine, fine. I'll go and have another look. See that you did. I do. Notice you. you. Sorry. As anyway, we know, apparently there's like Zoe a... Washington will host Janus's wake. But now it seems an antique ceremonial dagger, which Janus is supposed to wear during the service, has gone missing from storage. I suggest you Alright, so kill her with the dagger or something, I don't know. What's your plan of action? Anyway, that was the constant. He was being a weirdo. Don't mind me, sir. I won't. You're a nice guy. Bust. Oh, what a right. bust. Uh, hello, sir. Uh. Okay. Oh god, that's that guy's a fucking enforcer that like he literally will stop at nothing. The minute he like, no, a I don't care. You're Blake Nathaniel, right? <laughs> Nathaniel, you don't mind me asking. Not quite. Hey, constant guy. I'm constantly going to be trying to get you to notice me. Get it? That is the. All right. Now, stay on, okay? Don't look at here. Ah, uh, yes. Custodian, art collecting, illegal shit, blah blah blah. Break open this in crowbar. Crowbar. You're a crowbar, though. You drop something? That's the dagger. Disguise yourself as genius. He's dead. Are you telling me I have to kill? Wow. Harsh ass game. Okay, that's a little bit too uh, illegal. Is that? Run, run, run. What? Yes, that command. was me. Command, you there? What? Boot up. What? Uh, command, yeah, I'm here now. It's all clear. It's over. Show yourself. It's up to you right. whether this ends good or bad.
<laughs> what the hell is he holstering it on? Huh? Man! Oh my god. fall down. Anyway, now I'm one of those MF Doom guys. Hey, Look, I don't know what they are. are. you okay? What? I don't think that's what the constant sounds like. Mr. Constant guy. There's a pulse. I guess it's your lucky day. Yeah. Someone help me! Someone help me! Why, if I didn't know any better, I'd say you died over yesterday. Final touch of makeup, your burial mask, and ceremonial dagger. Oh, why, you'll look like a king of old. My unique polymer trick. Shit! Whoa! What? Will someone help me? Ah! Oh, please! You will not knock anyone else out, you hear me, mister? Oh, no! Dead. Hmm. This takes me back. Oh hell Good yeah. Good thinking, 47. Get ready. Who gave the signal? Everything seems to be in order. Suppose we move ahead. Thank you for coming, everyone. Service shall begin in a moment. Hello? Help. Someone help. <laughs> this fucking guy's yelling. Thank you all for coming. As Janus's successor, it, it falls upon me to say a few words. I'll keep it brief, for there is little I can say that does the man justice. Janus was our founder, and like all true visionaries, he was far ahead of the curve. While we, the privileged class, were blissfully toasting the end of history, Janus saw the writing on the wall. As a veteran of the Cold War, Janus knew better than anyone that when true disaster strikes, the rich are as damned as everyone else, unless we work together. Janus never got to see the collapse, but died peacefully in his sleep. And yet, what he started in 1991 will one day be hailed as the dawn of a new age. One where the best among us can thrive, uninhibited. Among us? This is Janus's legacy. Long live his memory. And now, you are welcome to pay the Founder your last respects. I need 
anyway. These guys are all leaving. Silly Washington's gonna say a few rather so, personal words. here we are. You didn't want me and Sophia taking over. Fought us tooth and nail, but a fat lot of good it did you. The partners, they turned a deaf ear, and deep down, Janus, you know why. Because, for all your smarts, you're just rank and file. Pedestrian, middle class, blah. And we have the one thing Merit can't buy. Blue. Blood. That's right. Good old fashioned pedigree. That is why Sophia and me will one day be partners of Providence. Not on my watch, bitch. <laughs> Whoa. One target down. Nice work, 47. Next up, Sophia Washington. Lord Marnie. Official Cloud Serpent motto The Cloud Serpent. Damn. Okay, that's just weird now. It was lost for over 500 years until Blake Nathaniel unsealed the serpent's tomb. Extraordinary. Wow. By the way, they found. Oh, wow, they found Zoe Washington's body. Good. Fuck that little bitch. She's huh. dead. I know this is state of the art. Love her. No, I don't know anything. Perfect way. Looking good. Ah ha ha! I'm extremely powerful, so you're right. Hospital area, or whatever the fuck it says there. Ah, oh, yes, laptop ah, something for According to this email thread, Sophia Washington has recruited one of the architects in a plan to discredit the Constant. Sounds promising. Interesting. <laughs> The poison chip in the Constance neck was designed by a Kronstadt engineer, a Mr. Marek Sinclair, who also works for the Ark Society. Apparently, Sophia wants Sinclair to approach the Constant and offer to remove the chip. If the Constant takes the bait, Sophia can prove to the Providence partners that their top... Yeah, whatever. Okay. Identify Stinkler. Sinkler. Whatever it's name is. Oh, Raider. 47. Olivia is trying to locate Mr. Sinclair's cell number. See if we can't contact him directly. Stand by.
There. We have Sinclair's number. Making the call now. Keep your eyes peeled, 47. Yep. Uh-huh. My car's been what? No, it was not a no parking zone. I park there every day. Are you sure you've got the right license plate? Yeah, see, that's not mine. Do I sound like a soccer mom to you? Get your facts straight, ma'am. Good night. Yes. And what if I refuse? What's the worst that can happen? Sophia fires me? I'm still Kronstadt's chief technical designer, and I don't even believe in the collapse. Yeah, I'll be fine. Uh, I'll be just fine. Mother... Easy, Marek. It's not the lady's fault. Hate the game, not the player. Stop calling it this little guy. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Oh. Excuse me. Hello? The art what? No, I, I don't need pet insurance. That, that's just preposterous. Wait a minute, how did I know your voice? Didn't you just call me a minute ago? Uh-huh. Yes! God, seeing him argue with Olivia Hall on the phone is beautiful. Ugh, why me? Why me? Guess it's just one of that's out! That's Sinclair, all right. And those are the blueprints for the poison chip. Should come in handy. away from their constants. I gotta talk to this guy. Nice evening. I suppose. No robe, no mask. Oh, hi. Which rank are you? Oh, I'm more of an outside observer, Mr. Name's Sinclair. I'm chief technical designer at Kronstadt Industries. The name rings a bell. Here. I think it might interest you. What's this? I think you know. The chip in your neck is my design, which means I can override it for a price. Most interesting. Meet me at the tower and be discreet. We can't be seen together. Always am. Out of your way, sir. Oh, hi. God, the fucking way that the guy was like arguing with Zoe or fuck with whatever her name is over the phone. Um, like while she was repeatedly calling was so funny. It's like, I recognize your voice. You were calling me earlier. What is it that you want? I'm starting to get hold on the Good evening, sir. Please come in. Have a seat. It's lovely by the fireplace. Mm-hmm. May I see those blueprints again, please? Interesting. All right, Mr. Sinclair. I'm listening. Don't. In fact, forget all I said. Excuse me? This wasn't my idea. Sophia Washington. She's the one who told me to approach you. It's all a trap. Go on. I never asked why. I just went along because she's the boss. And you're telling me this now? Why? 
Let's just say I don't like to get my hands dirty. I see. Thank you for your candor, Mr. Sinclair. You have been most helpful. Hang on for a moment. Sophia, I need to see you at the tower. I'm sure you are, and no, it can't. Nicely done, 47. This should put Sophia oh, firmly yeah. in the doghouse. Did she just say Sophia firmly? I don't know. I am sorry you got dragged into this. Sophia is spectacularly ambitious. Unfortunately, like most people of her elk, she lacks humility and a sense of station. And who are you, exactly? A humble advisor. Nothing more. Power without responsibility. Nothing humble about that. Hmm. You have my interest, Mr. Sinclair. I think we'll speak again. For now, I you will excuse me. Sophia and I need to... clear the air. All right, oh, I'm yeah. here. Are you gonna tell me what's so damn important? Ah, Sophia. I just had a most illuminating conversation with a designer from Kronstadt Industries. A Mr. Sinclair. I believe you know each other. We've met. What of it? <sighs> I don't blame you for trying, Sophia. Just for failing. Upstairs. Now. God. The constant is pissed at Sophia. Can I try and get upstairs, theoretically? Oh, this is a pipe that leads upstairs, so yeah. It's your word against mine, you know. That's your play. I recommended you and Zoe to the partners against my mentor's wishes because I saw something in you. And this is how you repay me? You think because the partners noticed you that you have their trust, their confidence. I have served them for decades. And you don't even know their names. And yet, you're the one with a poison chip in your neck, and I'm the one holding the trigger. You? They gave it to you. Ouch. That's gotta sting. I mean, what a bitch. the constant is like the voice of God, right? Only he speaks for the partners. Surely they wouldn't dream of undermining his authority. Only, the partners are old school, aren't they? They recognize class, pedigree, birds of a feather, and all that. And you, you reek of middle class. You carry the stink of public transportation. And while you have spent decades climbing the corporate ladder, me and Zoe, We've got ourselves a private elevator, and it goes straight to the top. Don't fool yourself, Sophia. They may use you to punish me, but you're a tool, nothing more. And this pathetic ruse only shows me how much you have yet to learn. I've said my piece. We're done here, boss. Huh? Both targets oh. down. Impressive work, 47. And now, to confront the constant. Mr. Gray, what's your status? I'm at the helicopter, but the place is crawling with security. 
47, you better bring the Constant to one of the boats in the harbor where it's quiet. You can use the kill switch to coerce him. So I guess we just learned how much of a bitch Sophia Washington is. Um, now get back here, constant guy. I have constantly wanted what? to talk with you. Don't worry about it. Hey, get back here, Mr. Constant. My guess is that any impending collapse will go Okay. Down. The Washingtons are dead. I have the kill switch. What did you say? How could you know about that? You will head towards the harbor. No sudden moves. No signs. Or warnings. I will trigger the device if I need to. I know you. The boy in the picture. You have his eyes. You're Burnwood's assassin. Move. Here we go. Partners no more, I take it. I suppose you're right. I had a notion something didn't sit right with my mentor's betrayal. You murdered him, I take it, to get to me. Not just that. He had it coming. Interesting. It was my impression that you were cured of such sentiment. The good doctor built his serum specifically to target the seats of your emotions. Has Miss Burnwood's sense of justice rubbed off on you? I wonder. Just keep walking. For what it's worth, Janus always found Ortmeier's project oh, distasteful, well, not to mention inefficient. But alas, sometimes you have to play the hand you're dealt. Oh, I know. Take it, this is not an ICA-sanctioned operation. What exactly does Miss Burnwood plan to achieve by targeting her clients? Violating her own code? She's doing it for us. Us? What? I mean, show a little respect. Oh, I see. The, ink on the, the penny drops. I should have known. How does a man leave no trace? By not existing in the first place. Lucas Gray, or was it Subject 6? He died when the Institute went up in flames, but no body was ever produced. And unlike you, his rage never faded. So, now you want the partners, the men behind the curtain that have caused you all this pain? Well, before you go knocking down a wall, you better make sure it's not load-bearing. Move your ass. Get to that bald spot. 
Did you have like a Hello hole there, burned in your hair? So, yeah. Wow, we did it. 